everyone, it's your boy Norton Rad 89 here, bringing you another video today. For today's video, it's just going to be kind of chill, laid back. We are done with our Batman content for now, so now we're moving on to just some other videos. Wanted to go over my horror merch collection, so I have it kind of sectioned off right here. This whole little chunk right here is all my horror merch stuff, so we're going to look at this right now and show you what I got, and then I'll have either like on the screen, or I'll tell you while I'm talking, or on the screen I'll tell you like where I got them or where's the best place to pick them up if you want to get these shirts. So let's kick this off right here. We'll get with our first shirt right here. I love this design. These are cool. These shirts, you can find these. I believe I got this one from Hot Topic, I think. But yeah, FYE, Hot Topic, they have these kind of shirts, the mall, any kind of section like that where you want to go pick up. They have these designs of these shirts. This is a certain artist. I'm sorry, I forgot his name or the, her name that does these. But yeah, these are some really cool shirts. I want to get the one that says like my first knife fight. That one's really cool. All right, now we'll move on to Jason, Jason Voorhees jersey. This is Jason Voorhees, the jersey. I believe I love this one. This is kind of like a jammy shirt. I like wearing this one like for jammies or when I'm chilling watching some Friday the 13th in the middle of the night or something like that. This is like the perfect kind of shirt for that. Let's see what's next. Nightmare on Elm Street. Dream Warriors. You can catch these at Walmart. That's actually where I picked this up. This is the Dream Warriors line. I believe they have them at Walmart right now or last month or something like that is when I picked up this shirt. <clears throat> Let's see what's next. Friday the 13th. This is another comfortable shirt because this is pretty big on me. This shirt, it fits extra big, but I like this shirt. It's just so comfortable, and I like this design for Jason, and Friday the 13th is my favorite, so had to give it up. Like, oh, anytime I see Jason like stuff, I try to pick it up anytime. And what is this one? All right, my jack-o'-lantern shirt. This is kind of my themed Halloween jack-o'-lantern shirt. I like this one a lot. Really cool mouth. You can definitely tell that I've washed it a lot because it has kind of like that gray effect going on with the black. <laughs> All right, what's next? Oh, yeah. I got this one this year, too, from Spirit. This is from Spirit Halloween, the Candyman shirt. Yep, this one was pretty pimp. I was going to get the Ghostface one, but they were sold out of that one when I went, and, yeah, I ended up picking up Candyman because this I got this right before I checked out the new Candyman, too, that came out this year. And my sweater. I practically live in this sweater. This is my Jason sweater. My wife picked this up for me, I believe, from Spencer's Gifts is where she picked up this sweater. And like, oh, it says the Jason lives on the back. Like, oh, it's just, I live in the sweater. I freaking love this sweater so much. And yeah, Spencer's Gifts is where it's from. All right, what's next? Here we go. Nightmare on Elm Street. Some Freddy. We love Freddy. He's the bomb. This one right here. I like this Freddy shirt. This one's cool. This was the first Freddy shirt I ever got, actually. I really enjoyed this one. And I think that one was from Walmart, too. I believe, actually, that was from Walmart, too. Hellraiser. I actually picked this up, I think, at a local, like, kind of, like, used clothes place over here. I believe Savers is what it was. I think that's where I picked this shirt up for cheap, a used shirt, but it was, it was Pinhead. I had to freaking have this. <coughs> What's next? Oh, yeah, here we go. My Freddy vs. Jason kind of shirt right here. It has the Camp Crystal Lake 13 and then Elm Street right up here in the corner. Like, I think it's just pretty cool. Freddy and Jason on it. It has a cool design. It fits a little tight. It's pretty tight, but... I still like this shirt. This one I got from Fright Rags for the Halloween Kills. It has the long sleeve. You can see it has Halloween Kills on it. This was from Fright Rags, and yeah, shout out. I watched, I've already worn it a lot. You can tell, like, the orange is kind of going. I should probably stop doing that. But yeah, I, lo I love this shirt, too. That's pretty pimp. They have some really cool uh, designs that they do for horror shirts and horror merch. This one, I'm not too sure where I actually picked this shirt up. I'm going to have to try to find this one. But yeah, Freddie and Jason for my Christmas theme shirt. I usually wear this around the holiday Christmas time. Show everybody that I'm missing my horror, my Halloween. Always deep, close to my heart Halloween. Here we go. This one, my wife picked this one up for me. And I believe this one was at Spencer's Gifts, I think. <laughs> and this, this is a really cool, I like the saying on it, for real. And Michael Myers, like this is just classic, so... I really laughed when my wife picked up this one for me. <laughs> and here we have this one right here. Shout out to Nick from the Lost River Drive. And I saw he ended up picking up this shirt. This is a badass shirt for real. So shout out to Nick from the Lost River Drive. And go check out his channel. He does a lot of horror content too. And yeah, this shirt's just badass. You cannot pass on this shirt for real. <laughs> And here we are, Ghostbusters. We have my Ghostbusters themed shirt. I think I like the design of this one. It has like this kind of 80s colorization going on on it. 
you know what I mean? I don't wear too much pink, but when it is like involved in like 80s kind of designs and stuff like that, I'll be wearing it. <laughs> and what else? I don't, I count this one because this was a monster flick back in the day and Godzilla, he's, he's a monster creature feature flick, you know what I mean? So Godzilla, I kind of count that as like horror merch, you know what I mean? Because that original Gojira film from the late 60s, I believe, was pretty horrific. They painted Godzilla in not a pretty light and I love my Godzilla. And then here we are, I believe uh, my boy Christian Hanna Horror has this one. Check out his content too. He has his own YouTube channel and does a lot of cool collectible stuff and horror reviews and DVD stuff. But this is a badass shirt. Michael Myers with this kind of like samurai looking design and Japanese stuff going on. I like the way the pumpkin looks. That pumpkin is pretty pimp too. And I believe that will be it. No, we have one more. One more to show off my... Friday the 13th. I'm not sure where this one came from. I'll have to try to find this one, but it has the masks on the side right here. You can see that on both of the sleeves and stuff like that. I really enjoy this Friday the 13th merch. I actually got this for Christmas this past year. This was a gift from me, so that's why I might, I might have to ask the person who got it for me where they got it so I could write that down and have it on the video at the bottom of the screen. But that is all my horror merch, and I also do have a Texas Chainsaw Massacre shirt. I'll have the picture or the post right up here, right here. I had a picture of it. My wife actually wore that one to work today, so thank you for sticking around for me with this video of breezing through all the horror merchandise that I have. Like I said, I wish I could have so much more. I do have a lot of shirts and stuff like that, but... I have a lot of sports stuff and all kinds of other anime shirts and Batman shirts, but that was all my horror stuff. So thanks for sticking around with me, y'all, and leave your comments in the comments section. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a safe and happy day. Peace out.